I want to show you how to make your dashed lines look the right length in your drawing. So here is the beginning of a foundation plan and you'll notice that the, the foundation footing here, these dashed lines, uh, if we look at the layer properties, the footing is a dashed line. Okay, that should be right and the pier is a hidden line, that should be right, but why are they looking like this? Well, this is a big foundation, and these are little tiny eighth inch or quarter inch dashes. So here's what we need to do. We look at our viewport scale, and here we are in paper space, and hopefully we have set our viewport scale three sixteenths of an inch equals a foot. That seems to be what works the architectural scale that works for this drawing. All right. Now if you get your calculator and figure out how many three sixteenths are there in 12 inches, you will find out that this is the same as a scale of 1 to 64. So three sixteenths to a foot is the same as 1 to 64. So watch what we do. Watch the command line. I'm going to type a command LT scale. There it is. Enter a new line type scale factor. Right now it's defaulting to a scale of 1, but my viewport is a scale of 1 to 64. So I am going to type 64, enter. Watch what happens to my dashed lines. Yay! The pier blocks are still not looking right, but that's probably just due to the scale. Now let's go to paper space. And I lucked out. Um, the dashed lines are appearing. Sometimes they don't in paper space. Sometimes you'll come over here and they just look little tiny dashes or continuous lines. So what we always want to do is the next step, paper space LT scale. So P S L T scale. See how I'm typing that? Paper space LT scale is an on-off switch. And you know in uh, computer talk, zero is off and one is on. So, oh, here's why mine are looking all right. I already had it set off. You want paper space LT scale turned off. So zero, enter. And if it still does not look right, you type Regen, and not just regen, but regen all. And that regenerates all your viewports. So here's what's happening. Paper space LT scale is something that uh, architects in particular use. They often have great big sheets, D size or E size sheets, with multiple viewports on them. And they might have a different scale in each of those viewports. So if you turn paper space LT scale on, it's going to make your dashes the same length in every viewport, no matter what scale the viewport is. So let's say you have hidden lines for these pier blocks. If you turn this off, if you set that to 1, it would make every viewport display those dashes an eighth of an inch long. If you turn paper space LT scale off, zero, it will scale your, your dash lengths to match whatever the viewport scale is that you're in. And we only have one viewport, so 
uh, it's not such a big deal, but we always want to turn it off or zero. And then once you've turned it off, see here's where I turned it back off, then we regen, let me move my mouse over here where you can see it, we regen not just one viewport, but AutoCAD is thinking, hey, you might be an architect with a whole bunch of viewports on your sheet. So this command regenerates all the viewports you've got, no matter how big, what scale, or anything. So let's review. Our viewport scale in this drawing happened to be 3 sixteenths to a foot. It happened to be the same as 1 to 64. So I typed LT scale and I set my line type scale to 64 so that it would match my viewport. Then I went to paper space and I typed PS LT scale and I turned it off. I typed zero. Zero is off. I typed zero and then I typed regen all. And now all our dashes look good.